Well, people say, oh, you're so good being a foster carer, but you're not really, it's totally selfish and an absolute complete pleasure and I love it and I can't imagine not doing it. My first foster fail was Possum, who was Popeye, and he came into the RSPCA when he was only five weeks old. I think June isn't a good month for me because I foster failed in June 18, June 19 and I adopted in June 20. I like reading, so about three quarters of an hour every afternoon I go into the kitten room and I just sit on the floor. Allegedly I read because half the time they try and rip the book out of my hands. I've got a towel that I put over my legs for self-protection from all their little cute needle sharp claws. Sometimes you can be really lucky. You'll get a group of kittens who are healthy right from go and they're happy and they play. Sometimes you'll get a group of kittens, maybe five black ones, and you've got to put a little dog of nail polish on each ear so that you know which one's which. But it's amazing, after two or three days you can pick them apart. They're like little kids. RSPCA are really supportive. They provide your litter, your food, advice, vet services. There's a foster care page and when you get new carers come in, I mean, there's a lot of experience on that page. And we always say, no questions, silly. And I always say to people, if you're thinking about fostering, do it. <laughs>